This question is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your WordPress questions or tasks on demand. So here is the WordPress documentation for how to use the get underscore posts function. So here I'm going to navigate to the WordPress website and demonstrate how it works. So first, head into the WordPress website and make sure you're logged in. Then go to dashboard and then head down to appearance theme editor. Inside of the theme editor, head over to the single page. So page.php. Inside of here is where I will demonstrate how to use the get underscore post method. So first, before demonstrating, I want to show you really quick that the page that I will be using to test this. So opening up page in a new tab, you'll notice that I have a page titled test. And this is the page where I will demonstrate how to use the get post method. Now it is blank for now. And that is as I want it. So back inside of the themes, inside of PHP, I will type out some code. So I will check that if the page is equal to test, then let's try out this experiment to see how get the get post method works. So here are some posts. And I'll say the posts equals to get underscore posts. Then I want to print out the posts. Now it's time to update the file. So after the file has been updated, now head over to the web WordPress website, but go to the test page. Now inside of the test page, you will notice that all of my posts have been printed to the screen. So over here in get post, it takes an optional ar array of arguments. So possible arguments include number of posts, category, include, exclude, and suppress filters. So here's an example. And scrolling down, you see that someone has uh, given an example of using the arguments array and passing it into the get post method. So let's do the same. So I will copy this a bit of code, head over to the page.php, and in here, I will paste this bit of code. So this is the arguments, and it says the number of posts to display, and I'll change this to one. And then I will tell the get post method to, to run based on the arguments provided. So these arguments will be fed into the get posts method. And now when I update the file and I head back to the test page and I reload, you will notice that I now only have one post. And how you know that is you head over here to post title. You can copy that. And then when you do a control F or command F to search for post title, you'll notice that there's only one search result. It says one of one. If this number of posts were to be changed to two and the page.php file updated, then heading back to tests and reloading, you'll notice that when searching for post title, this time it shows two of two two out of two. And if you want to add more different types of arguments here, you can simply go to, you can simply, uh, you can simply add arguments based on these types. So if you want to add category, for example, you can copy in category and put a comma and type in category, category, 
and then here you can put in whatever category you'd want and then you can update and update and then test it out again so that is how you use the get underscore posts uh, function in WordPress.